हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड प्रॉब्लम्स ऑन कॉलपिट्स ऑसिलेटर लेट अस कंसीडर द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम इन कॉलपिट्स ऑसिलेटर c1 इज 1 नैनो फैरेड c2 इज 99 नैनो फैरेड l इज 1.5 मिली हेनरी एंड बीटा इज गिवन एज 110 here we need to calculate the frequency of oscillation and check the condition for oscillation we can find frequency of oscillation by using the formula f is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi square root of l into c equivalence here c equivalence for colpit oscillator will be equal to c1 c2 divided by c1 plus c2 If we substitute the value, we'll get one nanofarad multiplied with ninety-nine nanofarad divided by one nanofarad plus ninety-nine nanofarad. So we'll get C equivalence is equal to zero point nine nine nanofarad. Now let us substitute this value in the formula of frequency of oscillation. So we'll get F is equal to One divided by two pi square root of L is one point five milli henry multiplied with C equivalence is zero point nine nine nano farad. So, if we solve this, we will get frequency of oscillation is one thirty point six kilo hertz. So, this is the frequency of oscillation. now to check the condition for oscillation let us consider beta which should be greater than c2 divided by c1 so if we substitute this value beta is nothing but 110 should be greater than 99 nanofarad divided by 1 nanofarad so we will get 110 is greater than 99 so which means it satisfies the condition for oscillation now let us consider the second problem in colpit oscillator c1 c2 is equal to c and l is equal to 100 micro henry the frequency of oscillation is 500 kilohertz we need to determine the value of c so to find the value of c let us find the value of c equivalence so from this we can find the value of c the frequency of oscillation can be given as f is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi square root of l into c equivalence if we square both lhs and rhs so we can write that as f square is equal to 1 divided by 4 pi square into l multiplied with c equivalence from this we can write c equivalence is equal to 1 divided by 4 pi square l into f square so if we substitute the value of l and f we will get 1 divided by 4 pi square l is 100 micro multiplied with f is 500 kilo 500 kilo whole square So, if we solve this, we'll get C equivalence is equal to 1.0132 nano farad. We know C equivalence can be given as C1 C2 divided by C1 plus C2. Since C1 is equal to C2 is equal to C, therefore we can write C equivalence is equal to C square divided by 2c so here square and this c we can cancel out so we will get c equivalence is equal to c by 2 from this we can write c is equal to 2 times c equivalence so if we substitute the value of c equivalence it will be 2 into 1.0132 nano farad therefore we can write c is equal to 2.026 nano farad so this is the value of c
this is about problems on culprits oscillator hope you have understood the topic thank you